In Episode 3, Rhinox develops a new comlink that works better over long distances. Cheetor volunteers to test it out and runs off. Scorponok, meanwhile, is attempting to extract a cannon from under some rocks. Cheetor recklessly engages Scorponok, despite Optimus ordering him not to. Hmm, hmm. Still operational. Megatron will be pleased. And you'll be slag if you don't stay right where you are, Clawful. Clicking makes me twitch, and there's a full charge in this beauty. Ah, ah, away from the big boomer, plug ugly. Cheater to base. I got the gig in hand. Tell Optimus to home in on my signal. Cheater to base. Come in, Rhinox. Ah, ah, ah. You're making me twitch again. And I'll make you scream. <laughs> Optimus homes in on Cheetor while Scorponok and Tarantulas make off with the cannon. Cheetor is patched up in the medbay and tries to justify his mistake. Yeah. Rhinox worked on that comlink for a month, and he doesn't have the components to build another one. You've cost us an advantage. I couldn't let him get away with that cannon! Oh yeah, you uh, you took care of that real good, kiddo. <laughs> Back off, rat face! Or I'll have a little vermin on a stick for lunch! You back off, now! Sorry, Optimus, I... Sorry isn't enough. We're in a war for survival, and you treat it like a game. If you had obeyed orders, all this could have been avoided. I'm going to call Dinobot in from the perimeter. We'll need his knowledge of the Predacon base to do something about that mega cannon. Well, I can get inside their base! Let me do it, Optimus! You've done enough. Cheetor runs off on his own to stop the Predacons, and Rhinox coaxes Rat Trap to follow after him. Tarantulas gets the drop on Cheetor again and webs him up. <laughs> You're in a stasis web. It drains away the energy, but leaves the flesh alive. At its current setting, this will take only a few moments. <laughs> But I find a slower pace makes the vital fluids taste so much better. <laughs> Whoa, you are one space happy spider. Cheater, maximize! I'm afraid the web makes that impossible. Cat you are and cat you stay. And when your energy's gone, I feel. <laughs> well, I'm going to have nightmares tonight. Dinobot insists on a frontal assault, but Optimus is keener to perform a stealth attack. Rat Trap sniffs out Cheetor and goes underground. And not long now. <laughs> this is a dumb plan, Webface. I don't have any real blood. Just mech fluid. Oh, my filters will adjust. It is the act I enjoy more than the nourishment. This is a kid's show, everybody. Rat Trap takes out Tarantulas and frees Cheetor. Game over, Vermin. Give my regards to the Inferno! The two return to the base and attempt to patch things up. Hey, uh, fearless leader, what's the haps? Where have you two been? Uh, just hucking around. 
You know, Cheeto needed some activity. You were kind of rough on him before. Everybody makes mistakes, you know. Well, maybe you're right. I'm sorry, Cheetor. I shouldn't have been so harsh. No, you were right, Big Bot. I messed up. But I won't do it again. From now on, this cat is a team player. I'm glad to hear it. Cheetor thanks Rat Trap for not telling Optimus what he did, hey, but Rat Trap assures him that if he does it again, he won't be as lucky. If I told Optimus about your little play date with Tarantulas, he'd kick my sweet pink butt too! And one more thing. If you ever pull a stunt like this again, I will personally rearrange your spots! Now, get out of my way! I got garbage to munch! Thanks for saving my life, pal. In episode 4, Optimus comes across a large deposit of Energon and tries to get in contact with the base. The Maximals are building scanners to keep track of the Predacons, while Dinobite is building a bomb. Some sort of trouble? Hey, Big Bot! Optimus calls off the mission due to a massive storm, and the other Maximals argue over it. The placement of those survey posts must be thoroughly calculated to avoid contact with any underground Energon deposits. I'm not just some dippy cub, you know. I can do this! Try having some faith in me for once! As much as you prefer to think so, Cheetor, this isn't about you. And does it matter if we blow some Energon? Maybe it will take a few Predacons with it. That is what we want, is it not? This mission, Dinobot, is to gain tactical advantage by taking out their base. Defeating them does not mean we have to annihilate them. You seem to have trouble understanding that. What I understand is this. If situations were reversed, Megatron would spare the base and annihilate us. Dinobot immediately begins manipulating Cheetor to plant the survey scanners. Yeah, well, I could show him a thing or two. Then, uh, why not do so? What? You have mapped every Energon deposit for 500 meters, and your land speed is unequaled. In fact, you are the only one who could pull off this mission. Cheetor plants the surveyors, but the weather takes its toll and causes the surveyor to begin malfunctioning. Okay. While attempting to extract it, Cheetor is teleported to the Predacon base and confronted by Pterosaur. Welcome to the dark side, Pterosaur! Terrorize! Yeah! Cheetor! Maximai! Did that already. Pterosaur hits a console and is teleported away to the maximum base, while Cheetor is left to take on Scorponok and Waspinator. Dinobot is already waiting for Pterosaur and deduces that the storm is enhancing their survey posts into a teleportation system. Pterosaur immediately sees this as a chance to form an alliance with Dinobot against the other factions. 
Dinobot betrays Pterosaur and shoves him out of a trash chute, knowing he can use this development to take out the Predacons. And we're partners! In case you had not realized, Needle Nose, I am not a team player. Cheetor begins hacking the Predacon computers and discovers that the Energon Reserve Optimus found runs under both of their bases. If one base is destroyed, the Energon detonates and takes the other base with it. He downloads this information and teleports it, but the bomb comes in after it. He convinces Megatron to let him disarm the bomb, and when he does, he escapes their clutches. Old bumble fingers! Five. Four. Three. And now, for you. Sorry, this cat's got a scat! Dinobot is less than pleased at this turn of events, and Optimus is less than happy that Cheetor disobeyed his orders again. But be warned, if you ever pull a stunt like that again, I'll have your tail in a sling. Okay, okay, I'll never do that again. Until the next time. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!